This is TCAP practice uh, question number 43. Uh, it says the triangle on the grid represents a section of Maisha's backyard. What is the closest to the length of side H in this triangle? Now they give you that box again that shows you A squared plus B squared equals C squared. So I'm going to write it out over the side here. Now in this case I'm going to look for a right angle which is right here and then I'm going to touch that right angle with my finger. I'm going to represent that by putting that little green dot there. From here what I'm going to do is uh, know that the two sides that make up those two would give me a squared plus b squared. So this is a squared, or a should I say, and this is b. Or you can switch them, it doesn't make any difference. In order to figure out how long they are, I'm going to use this really high level mathematical uh, system called counting. I'm just going to count, I mean really. Start here, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So one of them is 9. This, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, so the other is 5. You could also subtract if you like. Uh, so you do 11 minus 2, and it would give you 9. And I'm just going to put 9 squared. Uh, or you, and you could do 10 minus 5, which will give you 5. All I'm doing is plugging in 9 and 5 for A and B. Then I need to uh, do those squares. 9 squared is 81, and 5 squared is 25. Of course, as I'm telling you this, I dropped the pen on the floor, so give me a second. There we go. 81 plus 25. It's like solving an equation, so I need to combine those two things together. So 81 plus 25 gives me 106. And if you've seen any of the videos, the last step is always to take the square root. And the reason for that, again, is because this the equation only works because we're talking about the squares created by the two sides or by the three sides so the this huge square and this square will fit perfectly inside this big square here uh, in order to but I'm not looking for how many one by one boxes there are inside this square which would be what the 106 represents instead I just want the bottom part and the bottom part of any plant is called a root so we're looking for the root of this square so I need to take the square root the square root of 106 is 10.3, so my answer is B. Pretty simple, just write the formula down and plug it in.